France has launched a cash grab for much of the EU's €5 billion Euros emergency Brexit fund to bail out its fishermen. Emmanuel Macron wants to secure the lion's share of the so-called adjustment fund to prop up France's northern coastal communities set to lose out on access to Britain's fishing grounds. The French president's hardline approach to secure almost the same opportunities in the UK for EU vessels has taken negotiations over the Brexit trade deal to the brink of collapse. Having already frustrated European colleagues with this stance, Mr Macron now risks infuriating them by pushing to seize control of the Brexit fund. The cash pot was announced by European Council President Charles Michel to help countries adjust to Britain's departure from the bloc's single market and customs union. Certain member states began to see this whole fund as a sort of fish compensation fund, an EU diplomat said. Almost exclusively for fish, and almost exclusively for France. An EU official told the Irish Times, lots of countries are eyeing up that fund, France are looking to dip into the fund. It will be a lively debate between member states and the Commission. Mr Macron faces his second presidential election in 2020 with northern coastal communities set to be one of the key battlegrounds. Eurosceptic Marine Le Pen is expected to weaponize the possibility of French fishermen losing access to their traditional waters in a bid to unseat her rival. The European Commission is currently drawing up plans to distribute the cash to the countries most impacted by Brexit, but lobbying by member states is expected to sway the opinion of Eurocrats working on the project. Ireland is pushing for broad rules on how the money can be used, to allow Dublin to prop up multiple sectors across the economy hit by the end of the transition period. Belgium and the Netherlands are also expected to be hit hard because of their close geographical proximity to Britain. The fund could be dramatically changed in size if a Brexit trade deal is secured before the end of the year. Yesterday Ursula von der Leyen urged EU leaders to back a Brexit compromise with Boris Johnson, just as her chief negotiator Michel Barnier threatened to abandon talks. The Commission president said the bloc had to be creative on the sticking points of fishing rights and common standards. But Brussels sources said Mr Barnier told UK counterpart Lord Frost the EU team will travel to London for negotiations only if he felt a breakthrough could be made this weekend. Mr Barnier was said to be frustrated by pointless talks where Lord Frost EU refused demands.